is there such thing as a good virus? Now, this might seem like a strange thing to ask. When we think of viruses, we tend to think of the big baddies like flu and HIV that are exceptionally good at spreading disease. Even Hollywood's cottoned on to our fear of viruses and has brought them to the red carpet as evil, fast-spreading, quite deadly villains. But what if we could use viruses to treat diseases like cancer? Now, this idea has been around for about a century, and it's based on a natural phenomenon. Doctors treating children with cancer noticed that some who got a measles virus infection had a spontaneous reduction in their tumours. It turns out that the measles virus prefers to grow in tumour cells, as they're programmed to just grow and grow and grow. And this is exactly what the virus wants to do, so it can really thrive in them. The beauty of this is that when the virus has grown enough, it sets off small explosions in the cell to bust the cell open. This kills the tumour cell, and it allows the virus to escape and spread through the tumour. Now, we've known about this for a long time, but what's exciting is that we now have the tools and the technology and the knowledge to do something about it. We know how the measles virus works, so we can ensure that it will only infect cancer cells and not healthy cells to prevent any bad side effects. So, for a measles virus to get into a cell in our body, it uses a key on its surface. It's cleverly developed this key to fit a lock on the surface of our cells. Now, when the key fits the lock, it opens a doorway for the virus into the cell. We also know that when a cell becomes cancerous, it changes its locks compared to healthy cells. So we can modify the virus key so that it, has a, it will only open the lock on cancer cells, allowing it to invade like a well-targeted SWAT team. We can also give this SWAT team a secret weapon. The virus can carry in a protein that will convert a harmless drug that you could give the patient into a highly lethal substance to poison the cancer cells from the inside in a double whammy, cancer-killing effect. It's not just the measles virus that could be good at this. Scientists are staging all kinds of virus versus cancer battles with some exciting results. It might take a while to match the right virus with the right cancer, but if this therapy works, these villainous viruses could be the good guys in disguise. Thank you. <laughs>